everyone else um, when you have when you have a, a thing that's going on um, know that the body is telling you something it's telling you more than there's something wrong it's um, if it's holding and this is where your own discernment gets useful you know if you notice that it holds when you move um, it's trying to stop movement for whatever reason so you have to back off to a place where it's not being forced to move by your external actions. So for example, if, if, if your lower back is holding, um, it's doing something. It's do, in this case, it's trying to pull my weight forwards, right? Um, so, okay, you're back. So uh, uh, the, the body's telling you something. Um, so maybe it's protecting against movement. That's one possibility. So if if the body is holding, there's for a re it's for a reason. So the fir first thing you have to do is stop doing the thing that's making it hold. So find a different situation. It might be it's too heavy on your base. It might be you need to be lie down. It might be you need to stand up. Who knows? But you find a different situation where it where it doesn't have to hold. You breathe into the place that was holding. And when you release the breath, you go inside. And then when you find inner support for the place, then it might have a reason for letting go. Because it's, there's support that doesn't mean you have to hold yourself together there. Do you know what I mean? So when, whenever there's anything going on, it's not just your body letting you down. There, there's something that the body is telling you that you need to tune into, not just go, well, that, that bit's bad, you know? You have to, you personally have to go to the place where it's not doing that thing, get it to breathe, and then find something else. And usually it's an inner response in the area that needs to happen, okay? Now it could be, it could be that the rest of the body is sitting against that place at all times, and it's used to having to hold on because what you do makes it have to, okay? Same thing. You relax, you find a way of not holding on. So you have to notice that transition from holding on to not holding on. Or if it's a pulled muscle, you have to find a place where the muscle is not being pulled. And it's just because bones are uh, in a place relative to each other. If the, if, the, if the bones don't want to be pulled apart, it might, could be that, if the bones don't want to be pulled apart, the muscle will hold. So you put the bones back together. You know, you play until the place lets go, and you get you gain some sort of information about that, about what's going on when you find that. You breathe to give it some sort of reason for letting go, for moving, and then you find support some other way. And if you can do that, that will feed into all movement. Okay. It's just a general sort of state of mind uh, in terms of relationship to the body's voice uh, when the body is speaking to you. Because the, the main problem we have um, in the way we think about the body is we separate from it because it is doing stuff to us. And, it, and that's not true. It's, it's, ta it's talking to us. Yeah. <laughs> Yes. So you, you, yes, yes. So you haven't got the second part of it. All right. I feel tension in my bicep. Okay. So um, I want to let go of tension. I can't. I can't do the thing that I was wanting to do. But I'm wanting to do this, and I've got tension in my bicep. I have to find another way yeah. of supporting yeah. it that doesn't involve the, the tension. Yeah, 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 yeah. You get it? The body isn't doing it to you, it's following your instructions. Uh, if it's holding on, whilst we're, if you let it go and it hurts more, it's because there's not enough support. And the support comes from within. It's you. Your inner responses. And it's not you supporting that bit of your body, it's you relating to support from within that can allow that place to stay safe. And that's what it's asking for. Mm -hmm. Okay?
And, I, uh, and uh, the, 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 the main instruction is when that happens, don't keep doing it. Back off, get clear, reapproach, taking care when you find a solution. And, uh, and the instructions I'm giving you, like this movement of space within here and relating to Earth and relating to space, this is how you can find that inner support. So, you, so if you've got that particular pain going on, then you have to refer what we're doing to how does that help this place let go and feel supported. Okay? And it, it might mean you, you lie down and look like you're not doing anything. But... Um, <laughs> but um, if, if, I, if I look well, then I'll see what you're doing and I'll leave you to it. And, uh, and if, I, if I don't look well and make you do stuff, then you tell me what you're doing and, I, and I'll leave you alone. Okay? Good. Okay, so um, yes, any, any other things to look at today for anyone?